with thanks to Roger Callahan for the gift of TFT in helping to heal the world. And thanks to the ATFT Foundation Trauma Relief Mission for their support. Um, we have now over a hundred community leaders now trained in TFT. We're going back to train even more this year. And we are also going to be looking at going to work with the uh, genocide, Rwanda Genocide Relief. Uh, their agency is going to be uh, holding one of the trainings that we'll be going to, uh, to train. This is the first time we'll get to train <coughs> some of the uh, therapists who uh, we hadn't met before uh, until the ending of this last, last trip. So there are pastors, counselors, teachers, community leaders, and over 30 who are trained in 2006 did a review session, and they requested a diagnostic training, which we'll be bringing to them. This, uh, the, what we're learning here, we'll be bringing to Rwanda this year. Um, previously trained teachers at El Shaddai shared the transformation of their students and their own lives and their own families as well during the, the review training. And here's uh, their very eager students in the class, the, the community leaders for the TFT trainings. <coughs> and oh, oops, there's um, Pastor Norman and um, Suzanne Connolly, who has done the uh, lead uh, trainer there. And you can see we have to use primitive things without the uh, electronic equipment. So we're drawing things on the board. And there they're practicing. These are some of the practitioners uh, from Rwanda and surrounding areas. And uh, Dottie Webster, Suzanne Connolly, and myself with the, um, and Pastor Norman is here. He was the lead interpreter. So we have empowerment and healing with thought field therapy. It's a self-treatment that can be taught to community leaders. Groups and classes of people and students can be taught the TFT treatments. The few who need further treatment then can then be worked with individually. And community members and students can share their knowledge with family and friends. And that's, that's the amazing thing too, when we first started working with the students, um, we were working with the kids and then they were so excited that of course then, and they remember how to do them, so that by the time we were getting into the afternoon, the kids are coming in and says, oh, we know what we're going to do. We're going to be, <laughs> so they already knew the treatments for that before we even got started. And it was just kind of an amazing thing to see. So we can make even more of a difference in helping to heal the world with TFT with your help because we would like to be able, there's, uh, the genocide has touched every single life, either directly or indirectly. And there is, is so much uh, healing of these traumas that need to be done and that if we can be training and working with as many people as we can. That's what we would like to be able to do to, and to empower them with the tools of TFT so that they can actually be training um, more and helping even more people. And uh, the, the children of Rwanda had asked me to convey to ATFT, to Roger Callahan, Thank you, and they say Murakoze in Kenyawandan, and thank you very much.